16 or 17 years ago in Germany uh, when the very first TCM hospital was opened in Germany and this was not easy but uh, it was a challenge to get this hospital accepted also by the government and so on and so uh, it was necessary that uh, the hospital established a scientific advisory board especially the safety issue was a very important part because the German government, the Bavarian government wanted to be sure that there is no harm and that uh, all the herbs which are applied are really safe and so I think uh, it's really a major challenge to establish a quality control system which guarantees identity of the materials, which guarantees that there is no contamination with pesticides, with heavy metals and so on, or with, with any microbial contamination. We faced uh, a lot of problems uh, in terms of nomenclature, for example. Of course, it's a challenge also to translate the names. We have uh, to find clear definitions of the raw materials, a clear botanical identification um, because if you just use the Chinese name, there may be different species, different botanical uh, species which are used and it cannot be accepted that you use one time this species, the other time this species. So this needs to be really standardized. Then, uh, of course, another challenge was the preparation of Chinese herbs because many of them are not used in the crude form, but they're processed, uh, blanched or roasted or cooked or whatever and uh, this again modifies the quality in a way and uh, so you have also to control that this process is really reproduced in the, in the very same way so you have to put a lot of efforts I think in the to get a reliable and consistent quality of these raw materials.